guys, what's going on? So today we're going to do a SolidWorks quick tip on silhouette edges. I'll show you guys the final product that we end up with as far as a sheet metal component, but this is how to convert the silhouette edges on any component so that you can use it in your sketch. So in this case we got round tubing. We're going to put a piece of sheet metal down in between here. Um, I'll give you guys a final product, but for right now we'll get silhouette edges. Happens to be on the top plane, so that's where we're going to start our sketch. And we're going to go ahead and select our silhouette edges. Basically those edges are edges that the plane passes through on the tube. They're on the outside and the inside. See, there's one on the inside. And we're going to convert into these, and then we're going to trim it out. And then once we exit our sketch, I've got sheet metal in my S shortcut menu. And we're going to use 14 gauge material. It's going down, so we're going to have to bring it up half the thickness of the material. Um, so here's our sheet metal part. I won't show you guys um, the following steps because it's sort of tedious. I'll go ahead and get this component generated and then show you the very last um, final product. All right, guys. So this is how the bracket ended up turning out. Uh, I'm not sure. You know, obviously that could could or might not be a final product. Um, this really is a mock frame. It's not actual measurements of anything. Just trying to get, like I said, an idea of the flow of um, the project. So that's how it turned out. Um, and that's uh, silhouette edges for you guys who are wondering. Thanks, and I hope this helps someone.